a top World Health Organization official on Monday said that it was still too early to say if the COVID-19 Omicron variant is milder than other strains. On the other hand, WHO chief says the world must pull together and make the difficult choices needed to end the COVID-19 pandemic within the next year. New Zealand delayed the planned reopening of its international border because of the sweeping spread of Omicron around the world on Tuesday, a major New Year celebration in London will be cancelled, the British capital's mayor said as several other countries reimposed social distancing measures. On the other side, Kenya's coronavirus infections rate hit the highest level and rose to 29.6% from 24.4% in one day. The International Monetary Fund said its executive board has granted a fifth and final round of debt relief for 25 low-income countries to tackle the consequences of the coronavirus pandemic. The tranche completes the two-year pandemic-related debt service first approved in April 2020, providing roughly $964 million in relief to eligible countries. death toll from a suspected arson attack at a psychiatric clinic in Japan has risen to 25, with the death of a woman believed to be in her 20s on early Tuesday, local media reported. A 61-year-old man is suspected of starting the fire in Japan's Osaka on Friday. The herdsmen killed 20 tiff farmers in Nigerian state between Friday and Monday in what was reported to be a reprisal. The pan-northern socio-political organization cries out against killings in the north. The ACF slammed the president and northern governors for not visiting, empathizing with victims of attacks in the region. Pakistan has lost four people to the coronavirus. 270 new infections were detected in the last 24 hours. According to NCOC, the positivity rate was recorded at 0.63%. The National Command and Operation Center allowed booster shots for people over the age of 30 years as COVID-19's latest strain, Omicron, infects 58,000 people in 95 countries. Mix and match booster vaccine shots have been permitted free of cost. Prime Minister Imran Khan Tuesday conceded defeat in the first phase of the KPK local government elections 2021, admitting that wrong candidate selection was a major cause for the PTI's shock defeat in the recent polls. The ruling party could not grab even a single mayor seat out of the four. The PTI could only manage to win one tehsil in Peshawar out of six tehsils. Abid Ali, a right-handed batter in test cricket, was rushed to the hospital after he suffered chest pain while batting during a Quade Azam trophy match in Karachi. Abid Ali has undergone a number of medical examinations and is currently under observation. The numbers are staggering, $10 billion. 25 years of design and development. The ability to see billions of years into the past. NASA is anxious to send James Webb Space Telescope to space. The telescope has already seen its fair share of challenges, delays caused by hardware hiccups, work pauses due to its sheer complexity. If schedules hold, Webb will start its 10-year mission on Christmas Eve.